paying homage to my grandmother again, I, I said to myself, all right, we're going to go back to the 60s, you know, and think about, you know, her time um, that she lived in. And I saw some other Andy Warhols uh, in the L.A. Museum. I said, well, here's Andy Warhol paying homage to, you know, Marilyn Monroe. And he's repeat, he's able to repeat the image over and over and over and over and over and over. And I'm like, well, I think my grandma's pretty cool. I think she's pretty special. I mean, why can't I repeat her image over and over? But I didn't do that. What I wound up doing is um, I, I, I said, well, what sort of kind of super group um, was, you know, who, who, which, who made up an impact in the 60s? And it was the Freedom Riders. Um, and I said, well, instead of just doing women and men, like painting their portraits, why not just paint the women, which would pay homage to my grandmother and all the women, the strong women across, you know, in this world, in this country. Um, but do it differently. 